You will need a 9 16th wrench, 60 milliliter syringes, cleaning solution, and clean water. Press MAINT on the TD120 control unit to enter maintenance mode. Press the down arrow until manual cleaning is highlighted. Press ENTER to select manual cleaning. The valve will rotate from process to closed. While that is happening, fill a 60 milliliter syringe with clean water. Attach the syringe to the lure lock fitting. Slowly inject clean water into the flow cell. Remove the syringe from the lure lock fitting. The cell condition will be displayed on the screen. Press Enter to advance to the next screen in the cleaning cycle. Fill a new 60 milliliter syringe with cleaning solution. Attach the syringe to the lure lock fitting. Slowly inject the cleaning solution into the flow cell. Remove the syringe from the lure lock fitting. Use the 9 16th wrench to remove the cap from the cleaning port located on top of the start sensor. Insert a brush into the flow cell through the cleaning port. Aggressively move the brush up and down to clean the flow cell. Replace the cleaning port cap and tighten with the 9 16th wrench. Refill the first syringe with clean water. Press Enter to advance to the next screen in the cleaning cycle. Attach the syringe to the lure lock fitting. Slowly inject the clean water into the flow cell. Remove the syringe from the lure lock fitting. The cell condition will be displayed on the screen. The cell condition should be near 100%. If it is not, press the right arrow key to repeat the cleaning. If it is, press Enter to exit the cleaning cycle. Press Home to return to the home screen and normal monitoring. If you have latched alarms, they may be displayed on the home screen. Press Enter to acknowledge the alarms. The valve will rotate from closed to process.